All right, uh, let's look at the homework 1.6, problem number five, right? So we want to evaluate this limit, right? So let's do that. All right, so first thing we should try is uh, plug in, uh, you know, h equals zero. So you can see that the denominator uh, goes to zero. And if you plug in zero here, uh, square root of 16 plus zero will be four minus four. So you can see that the numerator also goes to zero, right? So we have to do something, right? Then what we can do is uh, we can use the trick. Uh, remember that uh, whenever you have, uh, say, a minus b times quantity a plus b, then this is going to give you the difference of squares so a squared minus b squared right so we're going to use this uh, to simplify right so what we're going to do is we're going to multiply top and bottom by exactly the same thing right so uh, it's almost like a numerator so we're going to have square root of uh, 16 plus h but the sign is instead of a negative sign we're going to put a positive sign here and the 4. And you're going to do exactly the same thing to the denominator uh, so that uh, we don't change the quantity. All right, so we have that. All right, so let's multiply that out. So you have a limit right, as uh, h approaches 0. All right. And what happens is that when you multiply them together, uh, we're going to have a squared. So this is like a. So if you square that, you're just going to get the 16 plus h, right, minus, right, b squared would be uh, 4 squared. So that's 16. And on the bottom, uh, you can't really do too much. So I'll just say h times. Uh, square root of 16 plus h uh, plus 4. All right? But we can simplify uh, this guy. You can see that there's a positive 16 here and that there's minus 16, so you can cancel that out. Yeah, all right? Then you have a h on top by itself, and there's a h on the bottom, so you can cancel h's. So you're gonna end up with one on top, right? Then uh, you you have uh, h going to zero, so this guy is going to zero, right? So what's left is going to be, so you have one on top, so that's. Uh, that's easy to figure out. Right here, you have square root of 16 plus 0, which is 4. Square root of 16 is 4. And you're adding 4 to it. So 4 plus 4 is 8. All right? So 1 over 8 is uh, what we're looking for. All right? So this is the limit. All right? So let's type it in. All right, so what we got was uh, 1 over 8, so 1 over 8. So I'm going to go down and check the answer. All right, uh, it came back and looks like we got this one correctly. All right, that's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.